guys since Dubs. Big shout out to CW Washington, Echo Stage, Pete, all the love fam out here in DC. Thank you for the love. We'll be back soon. Tonight's gonna be wicked wild. Let's go. As long as you're looking, I'm not going home. Oh, I've been dancing on my own, on my own. As long as you're looking, I don't feel alone. This music just been going on, going on. But as long as you're looking, I'm not going home. EP, Beautiful Disaster. How was it collaborating with like Juicy J? Juicy's our boy, I mean, um, we started a festival called Mount Uzi about a year ago, and uh, it, the first one started in Toronto, in our hometown, and we called up Juicy, and he came and performed it in like Carnage, and a bunch of like homies came, and we just established like a really cool friendship with them, and we're gonna produce some stuff for like his upcoming album, and he's been sending us verses, but yeah, Juicy's the man. Yeah, all your fans in DC are like super pumped to see you perform tonight. Well, I, I, like... can, I can already hear them out there, and it sounds it sounds crazy. I'm so excited to go out there. Yeah, has there been any particular thing that you've got from a fan that's like really motivated you or like inspired you? These two girls flew to our hometown show from Israel. Wow. And they brought us gifts to a, a pop-up shop for our new merch, and it was like a bunch of like we love like reggae music and Bob Marley and like they got they got us like these cool Bob Marley shirts with dope sayings on them and they like wrote notes that nice. were like they're pretty lengthy things like to see what music can do to help someone you know like at a certain time in their life it's pretty it's pretty cool to see that your lyrics or your sound can like you know really help someone yeah and how have your fans been in DC? I mean DC has been one of the first markets that we cities that we came to play yeah and obviously. Can't go anywhere else. <laughs> yeah, I mean, Pete's the man. Yeah, like, of course. Pete's yeah. just the man. Like you can't. Yeah, four time. And we played this club called like whatever. I think it was like Fur or something. And ever since then, just the Echo Stage. Yeah. So. We opened here once. Like we did our first bus tour with Adventure Club, and they did a show here. I remember just seeing the venue. Like it holds a few thousand, but like when you actually look out, it, it's such a massive venue. And yeah. like to be able to come and have bunch of kids here to rock with you for a night, it's, it's a super big honor. <laughs>